up dogs my name is Rachel Black and welcome to another video on the University Housing Channel. For this video we're going to walk through a tour of Russell Hall and so this is the entrance to the second floor which is where the lobby is so I'm going to take you a tour of that but real Rural Hall residents don't use the first floor. Okay, so once you get past the lobby, we have this little lounge area, and then we're gonna come over here, and right here at the entrance, we have our mail room. You receive packages here, you have little mailboxes, and you can also send mail from here. Here at Russell, we have a market on our first floor. You can access it from outside or inside the building, and I really like to go in there for the berries. They're really good. Okay, so in Russell, we have a lot of space on the first floor for studying. There's also a lot of studying on the third floor, and we're going to head to that soon. But from here, most students enter because you can take an elevator straight from the doors up. You have to have a student ID to get in because safety. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. So once you come off the elevators here on the third floor, residents live to the left, but we're gonna go through the right and we're gonna see a study area, a laundry room, and a big kitchen. This is the laundry area. I filmed a different video about all about laundry. It should be up by now, you guys should go check it out. It's laundry etiquette, and part of it was from here. Through the laundry room, you come here, and we have a big study room here. It's really open but through here we have our kitchen. Oof. And we have ovens, a big fridge, microwaves, big table, and our only ice machine. We also have three study rooms. We have this big one in here, and we also have two small ones, and we're gonna go check one out. We have two rooms that look about like this. They're nice. So this is the fourth floor. Every floor in Russell actually has a different color. This one's blue, and the third floor was also blue, but it alternates, I promise. But something different about this floor is that they have a study lounge over there. Some floors have study lounges, and other floors have warming kitchens, and we're gonna go check some out. So every floor that has a warming kitchen also has a really big lounge like this that's different than the small lounges that I'm going to show you guys. So this is the sixth floor. It is the quiet lounge, but we have couches, a TV, little chairs over here, and a nice big table that if you want to work in here too, you can. This is the dungeon. It's a place that's, there are no windows, so it's kind of dark but it might be good for you to study in and it's on every floor they look a little bit different sometimes I know on the seventh floor it looks a little bit different but it's near the west hall on the seventh floor this is what we have as our dungeon but there are windows so it's a little bit better than just the closed space that was on the sixth floor so this is the seventh floor which is the floor that I live on and this is our open lounge every floor has an open lounge unlike the private lounge or the warming kitchens. Right now I'm gonna take you guys through my hall to see what a hall looks like here. Welcome to my home. As you can see, we have this really long hallway. Uh, my room's all the way at the end, which is cool. So right now we're outside of mine and Hunter's room. You guys met Hunter in the Halloween video. We're not gonna go in there right now, but just now that's where I live. So right now we're on the 8th floor, we're in their large study lounge, and I did not know this, but you can open the windows just a little bit to get a little bit of air in here, which is really nice in my opinion. So this is the ninth floor, whose color is teal, and they have a warming kitchen, which honestly just consists of a microwave and a big sink, which would honestly be really useful when you're washing your dishes or doing your homework or trying to eat with some friends. So every floor also has a phone room. This is the 10th floor's phone room, which is also teal. Can you hear me? Although the phone rooms are great, they're not that private, so if you're having a really secret conversation, have it in your room. 
Thank you guys so much for watching this video. This is again the second floor and thank you guys for coming on this channel and continuing to watch the videos. Please subscribe, give this video a like, and keep on watching. I'll see you guys really soon. Bye!